It seemed only fitting that today's launch of ticket sales for the clash with Scotland featured two former Wallabies born and bred in the Hunter. I think it's just wonderful that uh, the Newcastle people are going to have their, their own test match and uh, hopefully uh, Scotland will step up to the mark. Once you get involved in rugby it sort of gets in your blood and, and you're always involved in it so to see a game like this in, in the valley it's um, going to be tremendous. Current Wallaby Pat McKay believes Australia has learned from last year's World Cup and the game in Newcastle will be a good gauge of the side's prospects in 2012. You can't play against another a proud nation like Scotland and, and take it lightly so uh, I'd say it'll be a strong team picked and, and we'll have to be at our best to win. For Ben Alexander, the memory of Australia's last clash with Scotland cuts deep. He's missed it. He has missed it. You only get to play these teams once every few years and um, you know, I've only got to play Scotland once and unfortunately I lost and that's had to, I haven't had a chance to rectify that. Alexander has enjoyed a meteoric rise into the Wallaby scrum but isn't taking anything for granted. You always uh, got to fight for your position. Um, you know, there's a lot of great props and a lot of good front rowers at the moment in, in Australian rugby and um, the moment you take your position for granted is the moment you won't get picked. Mitchell Hughes, NBN News.